when it comes to wine and holidays, Savannah has a saying, if it pours, it's okay. <laughs> Not Jeff this Rawson year. <laughs> is here, though, with a question of whether you should splurge on expensive wine. He's so generous. You know, he offered to do this taste test and yeah. really <laughs> get involved in the story just in time for your holiday party. Jeff, good morning. Just in time for you to be pregnant and not being I able know. to taste it, I know. Bummer. How's that for timing? Thanksgiving is just days away, guys. And if you're having family over like I am, you're out buying lots of wine right now. So many of us think that we can taste the difference between expensive wine and the cheap stuff, which is which. But can you really? And what if it was wine out of a box? This morning, a little experiment that could save you big money. We are throwing a party, red or white? White. Inviting this group of Today Show viewers to a Rossin Reports wine tasting. I'm a wino. On the menu today, this fancy looking Pinot Noir and Sauvignon Blanc. But here's what these wine lovers don't know. It's really inexpensive wine out of a box. That's right, hours before the party, my team got a bunch of empty wine bottles and poured boxed wine into them, complete with fancy looking labels we printed up. We even made up an expensive sounding name in French. What du vin? In English, that's box of wine. Will these party goers really believe it's high end wine just because it looks fancy? Right away, the wine is flowing. Very smooth. It tastes like a French Sauvignon Blanc. I smell oak. But there's something else they don't know. One of our guests isn't really a guest. It's Linda Passante, a branding and marketing expert. I'm going to speak in a hushed tone because I don't want them to hear us. But what's at okay. play here? The power of persuasion. You put wine in a fine bottle, so they believe they're drinking a fine bottle of wine. So when I ask them what they think of this wine, what do you think they're going to say to me? They're going to give you an account of how good it is and why. What do you guys think? I like it. It's, it's a refreshing wine. It's refreshing? Yes. That sounds good. What do you think of yours? Uh, it's really smooth. The praise just keeps coming. Would you order this in a restaurant? Oh, definitely, yeah. It's very yummy. What do you think? I like it. There's a little air of spice to it. A spice to yes. it. You like that? So it tastes almost like a Spanish or Argentinian. Oh, yeah. I like it. It's very full bodied, but it doesn't linger. The boxed wine works out to about $5 a bottle, but how much would they pay for it? 20 25 something like that, maybe. Probably 50 40 50 Okay, we're going to ramp things up now and do a little taste test. We took that same boxed wine and poured it into separate wine glasses. We're going to ask them, hey, which wine do you like better? But remember, it's the same boxed wine. We test the reds. It's the same boxed wine in both of the white wine glasses. We're going to see what they say. Tell me which of these wines you like better. Dying to know. The second one. You like that one better? Yeah. Why? This one has some character. It's got character? Yeah. Oh. This one's a little bit better. This one tastes a little bit acidic. Every single person we ask. The first one. This one. I feel like this is a little bit less sweet. Picking one wine over the other. I like that one better. Why? It tasted fuller to me. Remember, it's the exact same boxed wine in both glasses, but they all seem so confident. This one was a little bit tart compared to this one. OK, time to fess up. Do you guys want to know what we've really been up to tonight? Yeah. yeah. So you've enjoyed the wine. I've talked to a lot of you. You've enjoyed the wine. Yes! yes. Here's what you were really drinking. <laughs> Boxed wine. <Yay! laughs> oh, my god. <laughs> you surprised. Whoa, yes. I mean, that tasted amazing. There's another surprise. The taste test we did, yes. that was the same wine in both. What? <laughs> Just in time for Thanksgiving, yeah. go cheap. Exactly. I'll use yeah. your bottle, though, instead. <laughs> Trick your guests. Exactly. And no, they want to know the oh difference. Cheers. Here is another reason to buy boxed wine, by the way. It actually lasts longer than bottled wine. It goes six to eight weeks after opening, and, and it's still really? good. Yeah, it's pretty cool, right? <laughs> All right, so we have, a little, we have a little taste test set up for you now. Since you've seen that, our, our trick is gone, so we can't have both the same right. wine in the same yeah. wine. Yeah. Makes so sense. we actually do have a $50 bottle of wine in one of these glasses okay. and the boxed wine in another. Yeah. It's Sauvignon Blanc, so I want you to taste well, each one. I'm going to do my Jeff Ross impersonation. I'm dying yeah. to know what you think. Okay, here we go. We need Hoda. That's the only real expert here. I know. Here. We should have brought well, excuse her. Excuse me. I had. A, <laughs> I know. I feel bad for you, Savannah. You I, can't have. I was an expert. You brought me yes, in as your yeah. taste tester. Have yeah. that one taste. It tastes just fine. A Thank sweet. you. 
<laughs> okay, here in we the go. process of a taste test. What I varietal is this, Jeff? It's Sauvignon, Sauvignon Blanc. Blanc. Okay, okay. Yes. One, one of my favorites. Get, what do we do? Now, which one you prefer? I want you to pick that card up from the one you prefer and just hold it up to the camera. Oh. So you prefer that one, you prefer that one, and you prefer that one. Uh, Matt prefers wow. the box wine. Oh. Al prefers expensive. Tamara prefers expensive. This was a little less sweet. Yeah. See, I thought this one was sweeter. I thought it was too sweet. But you had a mento in I have a mento in It might have been my bad. That was a strategic error. has been You're like Ernest and Julio Gallo over there with a mento. If you're having Matt over, go cheap. But you know what they say? Wow. Thank you for their support. Exactly. Can we finish it? Is it too early? Jim Joy. That's right. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.